Hey YouTube, how's it going? Another two minutes here with the Boss ME90 Tone Studio. In this video I'm just going to show you how to change the bank select settings on this unit. I'll show you what this means in a moment. Uh, so if we just go to system and what we want here is the play option. Now we're looking at this one here. Now you've got two options here. Uh, you've got a, a chance to actually choose your bank and number before the uh, the presets actually change. So with a lot of us over the years, that's the one we've kind of got used to. Now what that one means is that when you press the uh, bank up or down button, all of the four uh, switches within that bank will flash, letting you choose first which of them you hit. So as I'm sure if you like me, you've had these kind of units for years and years and all the, the different ones that we've had. That'd be the one that you're most used to and then you uh you know the four of them flash and then you pick the one that you want and then that preset is loaded now with the other one what happens is is uh this is just like a where well, you change it to immediately and what this actually means is that when you hit the uh the bank switch it means it actually changes to that set that number in that bank immediately so for example you're just in uh you know preset one and you want to go up to the next bank, bank number two, if you're in bank number one. As soon as you hit the bank button, that actually goes up to the first setting in the next bank, and that preset loads immediately. So for example, you want, you're want in preset one in that particular bank, and you just want to go up you know, to the next one, that same um, location in the next bank. So if you're in uh, setting one, and if you just hit the up bank button, that will go to setting one in the next bank up. And so that's what the immediately button means there and uh, the other one is let's just go back to bank and number that's why I prefer I'm sure you do too and the other one is the delay now if I actually select that off that means the delay sound will be cut off if you change your preset or bank you know to another sound straight away if you press that on that means that the delays actually carry over to the next um, setting so it doesn't cut off the delays uh, useful in a live situation if you're going out of a solo into back into the uh, the chords or something like that but uh, yeah i hope you find that easy to understand uh, please hit the subscribe button if you like what i do and uh, check out my boss me 90 tone shop as well thanks for listening see you later bye